What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. This video is actually being posted on Halloween, so I want to wish everyone a happy Halloween. Hope you guys enjoy the day. Big question for today. What's everyone's favorite candy? And I'll start my favorite. I love the peach rings or the peach discs and I love those Welch fruit snacks. Those are uh, always some of my favorite candies and I like a bunch of others too, but those are my favorites and uh, curious what you guys like the most too. Always love something, uh, something sweet. And today we actually have the ultimate trick or treat here. We have the select basketball lucky envelopes. If you're familiar with this format, you know that these are the biggest brisket for the biscuit product probably on the planet. So this stuff is uh, crazy. We'll be reviewing this box today. We have two of these and um, here are our Halloween review. The select lucky envelopes. Man, this is going to be interesting. Hopefully we get some good stuff. But yeah, so if you guys like these videos, help us out. Drop a like and subscribe and share and comment. Also ring the notification bell and be notified whenever we post. And then memberships are available. You can get bonus content like videos, badges, emojis. Uh, there's a join button next to the subscribe button and a link in the description that you can click on uh, with the red thing next to it. Can't miss it, but it helps us out. Helps us do more stuff like this. And um, yeah, we have we have these here. Let's get some information for this product. So when I say it's ultimate trick or treat, it really is. It is treat sometimes and it can be trick most of the time so uh, the resale it varies a lot it's uh, six hundred dollars roughly give or take a hundred bucks it just varies so much i've seen 500 i've seen 800 it just varies a ton so uh, somewhere in that kind of several hundred range just two cards per box only two cards and uh, one pack now every single card is numbered to eight so super super short print and uh, lucky number eight of course these are sold on the t-mall platform in asia now the select has 200 cards. 100 of those are rookies, which means that uh, you have pretty good odds. Prism is uh, one six, and then Optic is um, you know one one and fourth of the checklist. So select has the best odds. You obviously want those court sides, and the good thing about these is the court sides are just as I guess um, you know probable to hit as the others. The other two on the three tier kind of set. So hoping for some good rookies, and the odds for hitting those court sides top rookies are. Are not not too bad compared to so like maybe like a hobby box where those court sizes are only like two per box but uh, yeah so excited to get into these we got these two in the background we have anthony edwards and then actually from the lucky envelope prism we have uh, a coro number to eight and a pack and cards ig definitely uh check it out drop a follow if you haven't i post a bunch of stuff on there uh looks at 21 22 products a bunch of things like that so uh let's we'll start with let's we'll start with this one first this one has a little dent in it hopefully the cards are okay but let's see what's going on and predictions is today uh Gonna be trick or is it gonna be treat? We um we've had okay luck with these. Waiting for that that monster, and I've seen some monsters come out of these before, so we're hoping today's Halloween special is a uh, is a good one. So just two cards, a little bit of a crush box. I don't know. Maybe that was that's good luck. I'm not sure. We're gonna find out right now. So open these little boxes or envelopes, and inside is one little pack that's been just getting thrown around. That's it empty see that little dent in the box so two cards you really want a rookie or a superstar like a lebron a luka a curry kd something like that it's not a rookie so here we go first one up let's see how it goes let me know your thoughts on this this product here and um hopefully, hopefully it's a good one man also comment down below any uh what are your favorite things about halloween and do you have any traditions stuff you love about it but yeah so here we go first card up let's hope for a banger yeah, woo! Treat. Got Davies Bertons. Concourse. Yeah. Woohoo. So, this will be numbered to eight. I'll show the back of this card in a second. and But first, we'll show the uh, second card behind it, which I'm hoping is a good one. One thing I'll say about Lucky Envelopes, though, um, they can be they can be awful sometimes. They can be amazing. I've seen, like, some incredible pulls, like two amazing cards in one. But this could easily be, like, another Davies Berton. So, let's see. Once again, help us out by dropping a like and subscribing and share and comment. It's a it's a court side. Whew. And uh, once again, memberships are available. Here we go. Uh, I think the rookie logo, if it is, a, might be somewhere. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> no, it's Trick. It's Daniel Oturu. I, I want 2021 products to be over. Please. I, I pulled only Oturu all year. One of eight, Daniel Oturu. Oh, dude. One of eight. It's not even... It's actually almost impossible what I've done this year, which is pulled Daniel Oturu in every single hit I've ever gotten. I've only pulled Daniel Oturu this year. This this sucks, man. Only Oturu. At one point, he was PC, and then Grizzly said, nah, bye-bye. Another one of eight. So first printed for both. Both to eight. Oturu, courtside. If he's good, that's an amazing card of him, but... um. 
well, he's a two room. So I'm really hoping he can do something. But man, it is uh it's been an awful year for for our, our luck. We just pulled just Oturu, Riller, Mr. Big Head, um, Zeke Naji, and like a couple other guys. It, it's it's been a rough year, man. Can't wait for it to be over. But they, they need to drop that 21, 22 stuff like stat. We are we are getting annihilated out here. All right. We did get a rookie. We did get a rookie. And I think that one thing these sh boxes should have is one guaranteed rookie since it's 50% rookies. But who knows? You can get two vets. You can get two rookies. Really hoping we get one more rookie. And please, please, please be a good one. Daniel Tour. That, that man, if you guys have watched like at least one other video on the channel, you know just that's, that's crushing, man. It's... Not surprising, but it's crushing. There we go. All right. So, one more. One more. Second time. It's a charm. Empty box. All right. Do you think box one or box two? Now we do two boxes as a face off. Which one's the better one? And let's find out right now. Oh. All right. Packs are very delicate, too. Be very careful with them because only two cards are not very stable or sturdy, I'd say. All right, there we go. First card up. Wish us luck. First one is Andre Drummond. Oh my goodness. Okay. One more card. So far, this is the uh, trick of the century. It is. I think it's another uh, concourse. It is. Aaron A. Smith. It is a rookie. Okay, okay, okay. It is numbered four of eight. Much better than. Oh, well, I mean, this is the court side, but it's a it's a two root. And A. Smith. We'll see what he does. Not the guy who we're kind of waiting on, seeing what he does. You know what? I'm. I would really, for some reason, had a feeling that was going to be Najee or a Hornet, and we know which Hornet it wouldn't be. So there we go. Now we open two. We got two rookies. It's not guaranteed you get a rookie, but it is fifty percent rookies in the checklist. Let me know your thoughts on this product. This is definitely probably the riskiest box you could open that I can think of. There's, there's others too, maybe like uh, one and one things like that. But this is so risky for several hundred dollars. It, it's crazy. But both cards will be numbered to eight. And um, man, it, it's a, it's a it's a rush. It's a quick one. But yeah, let me know your thoughts. Personally, I li I like the format. It can be tough. We've been fortunate to at least hit some rookies. No huge names yet. But um, at several hundred for two cards. The risk is crazy. I'm going to say it's a, um, I'll say it's a four out of 10 just cause it's just so much and so much risk associated with that ceiling is crazy high. I like the design thing looks cool, but just ridiculous risk. Probably the, like a top three risky product that exists. So we're format, I'd say. So there we go. A two guys can't make it up. All we do is hit a two and then we got this, uh, Naismith here, which isn't too bad. And then uh, the vets, vets didn't hit unfortunately. So does it for this one, guys. Let me know your thoughts once again below. Uh, happy Halloween to everyone. Hope you all enjoy the day. Once again, what's your favorite candies and uh, just Halloween traditions, things like that. What's your favorite thing about the holiday? But man, so this this is a scary bad, it looks like. So that does it for this one, guys. Hoping for a better look next time. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.